guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I have the Daisy palette. Oh, backwards. Uh, the BH Cosmetics X Daisy Marcus palette. Um, I just got in the mail yesterday. I'm gonna go ahead and open it right now. So it does come with 20 shades. There's, I believe, 10 mattes and 10 shimmers. Looks like this. It's pretty thick. So it opens up like this instead of a regular palette so that's really cool but the reason that it opens up like that is because you can set it inside the palette and it'll just drop like that and now it's a vanity oh god if it doesn't fall that's how the palette looks like i already have my face done and everything i'm just gonna go ahead and do one eye off camera and see what i create with this so i'll be right back Alright guys, so I just finished this side and did something a little simple. I'm gonna go ahead and get started on this side. I went ahead and primed my lid with some Tarte Shape Tape. I went ahead and started with the shade Naked right here. It's a um, nude color. And I'm taking the this brush. It's the M433. We're just gonna use this as our transition color. There's a little bit of fallout, but you know. Whatever. I'm gonna go ahead and set it on my crease right here. Kind of tap it in. And then we'll start blending once the shadow is set. Alright, and you can't really see this one on my eyes because it's almost the same color as my skin. But I'm just gonna go ahead and use this as a transition color just so everything else will blend. Okay. I'm keeping a clean blending brush on the side just so I can go ahead and blend as I use more colors. And I'm gonna go ahead and take this color, it is called Dulce. And I'm taking an M433 again. It's the same brush, but I just didn't want to use the one for the transition color. I'm gonna go ahead and tap it off. And I'm gonna set it right on the crease again. Tapping it in first. The shadows are pretty pigmented. This one is Dulce. I literally just tapped it two times. And that was pretty much all I needed. Alright, now I'm gonna take that clean blending brush. I'm gonna blend the top right here. Now I'm gonna go ahead and take Vintage. Yeah, Vintage is this orangey shade. With the another same brush m433 and again focusing this one on my crease now for this shade i'm not going to take it all the way up as i was doing for the last two shadows i'm going to kind of just tap this one i'm going to take the brush that we use for the shade Lisa, and blend the top so that Dulce and Vintage can blend nicely together. I'm going to take a smaller blending brush. It's, this one's more dense, so it's going to pick up more color. And it's the M456. And I'm taking the shade Coco. It's this really rich brown. And I'm going to go ahead and cut my brush. And for this one, you want to put it right on the outer corner, right here. And we're going to start blending it in towards this way. I'm going to go in with the brush that we used, um, the color Vintage. I'm going to go ahead and blend out. Vintage and cocoa. You need to go back and take some of that vintage color. Sit it right there on the outer edge. It's the NG325. It's the one I'm using to blend out all of my 
shadows. I'm gonna take the brush that we use for Coco. And I'm gonna go ahead and blend out the concealer with Coco. Just to make sure the concealer line isn't too harsh on the outer edge. I'm gonna take this flat brush. It's the M124. I'm gonna take the shade Icy, this one right here. And put it on my inner corner. I'm only going to drag this almost a third of the way through the cut crease. Now I'm going to take another flat brush. It's just an elf flat brush. And I'm going to take the shade Flower. I'm going to blend out white and the yellow. Going back and forth. The one we use for Coco. And then the, the yellow as well. Alright guys, now I'm going to add a little bit of eyeliner. I'm going to go ahead and take the NYX matte. I'm just going to create a little line on the top. I'm going to go ahead and add my mascara now. Put the visions for me. I'm gonna use Spiegel by Desi and Katie Collection. And it's their highlighter. I'm gonna go ahead and apply it in the inner corner. And now for my lips, I'm gonna take Strip Down. Go ahead and line my lips. And for lipstick, I'm going to take my main. It's also from Dose of Colors. A recap of the palette. So, I really like it. It has really pretty colors. This is the final look of the eyes. I would totally give it a 10 out of 10. Especially since it was only $20. Right now it is for $24, but still pretty cheap for 20 shadows. And they're pretty bomb. Hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And yeah, see you on the next video. Peace.